Hi, I'm Jule. I'm a student of art education and Kulturvermittlung and I build bridges through storytelling, writing, um, poetry, photography and collaborative art projects. And I'm interested in discovering and finding, exploring boundaries and differences in order to create spaces for a connection that go beyond borders, time, the known and the seen. Because right now we live in a world that is constantly changing and we're not only trying to catch up and to keep track, but we're also trying to find that safe space that allows us to slow down and to be and find ourselves like finding our identity, finding our way home. And so that's our sense of belonging. And this is a feeling that is so hard to find, hard to contain, difficult to describe, yet crucial for our well-being and how we situate ourselves in this world. Since I can remember, the topic of home has been fascinating me, or the even broader meaning of the German word Heimat. And I've never really felt attached to my home country in a sense that I would not miss anything. I would not have this feeling of missing home or being homesick while being abroad. More like missing a home outside of home. Over the past few years, I've created homes in various places. Places that um, allowed me to build something with what I found within myself places that challenged me and places that urged me to grow. So now this project has allowed me to find out what home means to other people, where they belong, where they can be, what they're longing for and where they belong. And all these people are part of my home, yet their understanding of home is different. And um, yeah, they just belong elsewhere. But there's something that we all share and that we all have in common, which is the journey to ourselves and the quest for home. Through my work, I want to understand how places and people that we call home shape our identities and impact our ways of sharing and connecting. Borders keep being constructed and fences keep being built. So the only thing that we can do is to challenge ourselves and to keep breaking the walls that we've built in our minds through sharing and listening, through creating and connecting. And I believe that sharing different stories of home and belonging does not only help understand each other and ourselves better, but it will also contribute to making walls crumble and prevent new walls from being built.
What is home? Where do I feel most at home? Where do I feel most at home? Home and feeling home like your home. It is the place where I can feel at home, where I can feel free, where I can be me. A place where I can be myself, where my books are on that shelf. Something that I've never knew. It is the before. village where I was born. Home. Where, as a child, I was riding a unicorn. Where I know every stone and where memories are torn. Ich verbinde mit Heimat unseren Dialekt, glaube ich. Oakville. It's where I got to know myself a lot better as a human being. Und um, das Meer, ganz besonders. It is the sweet and sticky smell of pancakes and applesauce. The food that my mom does. Home, definitely Korean food. This is home. It is the cause of all the battles I was fighting and the struggles that kept me inviting, rewriting this book of stories and injuries and memories. Home is not always beautiful. Sometimes we uh, romanticize what home is. Uh, sometimes we uh, like to fantasize and uh, create these like... At home. These illusions. Am I alone? Of what home is, but home is... A home. Home is sometimes a... Is it a house? Is it a place? Is it my space? My safe place. My own space where I'm not being disturbed. A place where I can breathe. The place that I call home. A place where I feel relief. So je me sens... A place that I... Me sens libre. Have to leave. Je me sens Going back there. Being surrounded by familiar looking monuments. It's my favorite city on this continent. And yet... No feeling of contentment, more like walking on wet cement. Just the city where I always went when I was a mess and searching for happiness. Ich habe diese Stadt einfach richtig in mein Herz geschlossen. It is the city that I used to call magnificent. Me being there now feels more like an accident, like I wanted to circumvent the biggest component of my fear of facing and embracing my differences and dreaming realities that sometimes displease. I never felt home like home anywhere. It is the compassion that I see in your eyes, your sympathy and empathy that lies between the words you say and the way you look at me. Ich glaube, ich brauch the people around you, Menschen, von denen ich mich verstanden fühle, they make a whole difference in your life. People who understand me. It is your arm around my neck when I feel like a wreck and it is your way to check if I'm all right which might not be the case since I need more space to spread my wings and fly away from home like the bird that sings in its nest. I always felt that a home, my place, my a nest, home base, which I don't want to find close to your chest, somewhere I could feel better, because I know is somewhere else that I would feel oppressed. What is home? Bon, est des gens que tu est de... Is it a place or is it people? Est des où tu vas? Is it the view from my village steeple? Is it a place? Is it my space? Wherever I can create art. A place where I can breathe. A place where I feel relief. Wenn ich akzeptiert werde, so wie ich bin. A place that I moving have to leave homes in order to find myself and who I am. Thus. After all those years of seeking and searching, in the world, of tossing and turning, displaced, of losing and confusing people, but mostly myself, I found home. Placed. I haven't found it next to our garden gnome, but I find it within myself and in who I am. Dass man in sich selbst auch irgendwo sein Zuhause findet. And I don't pretend being someone that I'm not, not even on Instagram. I now know that I am strong. Dans ton chez toi. I now know that I belong to my body and my mind. Être dans ton chez toi. And I will find my way home. Ton chez toi qui dépend que de toi. My home is a journey, a journey to myself. C'est quoi le chemin vers? It is a process. Vers la maison. And I am on my way. Home is where you can feel most comfortable. Because I create my own comfort, I belong anywhere. Relentless. Just feel like a sense of now you home in that sense too. Know your power and be yourself with. Pride, do not hide your talents and your uniqueness. Somewhere You'll feel relentlessly restless. I was disconnected from. Discover your identity, keep your individuality, and find your spirituality. Something that's complete. Not in a community, 
but in yourself. Something that's whole. Everything else is just an illusion. Not missing anything. Be your own home. I carry my home with me. And your own revolution. Something that was bigger than me. And make a contribution. My heart is in my art. Some music to gehört. La danse. Type of sounds I listen to, drums. I'm a music fan, and that's for me an art of a house or a zuflucht. A son, it's the sound of the tambour. Like a haven. It brings me to a place that I know, that has accompanied me in my life, that has helped me grow, that has followed me all the time. Pitimpa! As long as I can create wherever I am, I can create uh, a sense of home. Home for me, home is uh, is a taste. Home is is a taste. Home is. Que je vais arriver un jour, puis je vais être comme ah, j'ai toujours été chez moi. <rire>